What's up guys, it's me, your badass host Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Omega Ruby walkthrough. Okay, so in our last episode, we went through the first half of Route 120, answered a few questions, uh, messed up on one of them, uh, and I think right now we're going to be going up to the rest of Route 120 just to get to Lily Cove because, hey, you know what, we got to complete this walkthrough pretty soon here. The, coronavir the coronavirus is not going to stay forever. So let's go straight up right here, and uh, let's go ahead and find this right here. Now, there's a Pokemon waiting for us, which we will not capture. It's a, I think it's a Meryl or something, but yes, look at that. We found ourselves a full heal. Always nice to get that. Alrighty, okay, alrighty. Now, let's go straight up here, and let's go ahead and find a little bit more items. Now, I'm not going to capture that Pokemon because I already have it. So let's go right here and grab some Nana Berries. Yeah, buddy. Look at that. Or Nanab berries. Nanab. Nan. Okay, so the repel has wore off, so just a reminder of that. Anywho, guys, uh, let's see. I think I was answering questions. Yeah, last... I was ask, I was actually getting into the questions, getting on and off and all that stuff. Some of you guys may not have liked it or something like that, but... I think I'm going to try and do that on walkthroughs like this. Omega Ruby, Alpha Sapphire, uh, for Liquid Crystal. Mainly because they're not the main series games that I'm trying to focus on right here uh let's see let's see where is a repel where you need one let's see whose leg do you have to hum to get a rip god dang it there's no repels well i could do one of two things oh there it is oh look at that i was like i could have sworn I, I had some repels with me <laughs> okay so let's move on right here uh like i said guys i'm gonna try and answer some of you guys' questions onto these games right here uh some of you guys are brand new subscribers, which I'm very, very thankful for. And you guys may have wanted to know a little bit about me. So if you guys want some que questions answered, comment right here on Omega Ruby, Liquid Crystal. And, you know, who knows? I might just answer them right away or something. So let's go with the fly attack right here. Now we can use it, but we can o we could have always used it in, in battle right here. But look at this guy, Cacturn, looking like a beast. Looks like a scarecrow to me. And what the hell? Okay, so we're going to get hurt right here now. And, yeah, we do get hurt. Ah, oh, crud baskets. So let's go. Fly attack again. Alright. Now, in this game right here, you don't necessarily need fly for... I guess for uh, for flying, per se. And look at that. Super effective, but yet we're still going to get hurt a little. And here comes a little payback. And crud! Ah, oh, jeez. Okay, so we're, we're, we're getting our butts kicked right now. Uh, but eventually we're gonna get ourselves, what was it called again? The Flute. The Eon Flute, I think, and, uh, yeah. We'll be able to fly our Latios pretty soon here, too. And look at that. Gaia grows to level 40, and it's learning Future Sight. I do not want to teach it Future Sight, because it already has Psychic. It's a good move, and Sage of the Halo grows to 47. Sir Razor, in the last episode, grew 21 levels. And now it's starting to learn some basic moves that it should have it should have had. And uh, let's see, let's see. You know what? Let's go ahead and take away poison powder. Again, not really gonna use. Uh, what was it? Uh, what what you would call it? Sir Razor. Not until later on. I do have a plan for some of these Pokemon that I have not used in previous walkthroughs. Uh, probably gonna win the Elite Four right here. Now that I'm enabled to. And as you can see right here, this looks familiar. You guys already know what this uh, is capable of. We will be visiting that place in just a little bit, uh, a little bit later on. And uh, here we go, grabbing some more berries. Look at that, Nana berries all the way. Yeah, buddy. And here we go. Now, let's see. I've already dropped my episode 40 of my Pokemon Liquid Crystal walkthrough, and I did explain that I was gonna think. Well, I was thinking of coming out with another walkthrough pretty soon here. I'm not trying to do more than three, guys, because, uh, let's see. Like I said before, early on in this ep episode, uh, a coronavirus may not be here forever. Who knows? I might go back to my busy schedule at some point. That's why I'm stocking up on videos right now, because if and when we get out of this whole, uh, this whole, uh, quarantine, doesn't matter. I might need these episodes for one once a day, every day, and all that stuff. That way I don't have to stress about recording all these episodes. And I mentioned in my Liquid Crystal walkthrough that there, there, I was thinking of doing a game here and there. I don't know which one. 
So I left it to you guys onto my channel for voting. I came out with four. I think it was Pokemon the trading card game on the Game Boy. The hell? Goddamn ninjas. There was a uh, Pokemon Brown. Uh, that was a that's a hack game. And then I guess Pokemon Explorers or Pokemon Ranger for the Nintendo Game Boy Advance and Pokemon Coliseum. And that one, that game right there is a game that I have not played ever at all. And let's see, I think that's gone about for about I would like to say a, a good a good three weeks, two or three weeks. And I'm sorry, I'm like recording right here. <laughs> let's see, upload it. No, nope, I'm not gonna use upload right now. But yeah, that has been going on for about two to three weeks, and I had a, so far like 106 votes right there. And many of you guys have already spoken. You guys want to see Pokemon Coliseum, so that's exactly what I did. I bought myself a GameCube Pokemon Coliseum itself and the rest of the other stuff that comes with it. I actually thought that you needed a Game Boy player or a Game Boy Advance player for the GameCube to actually you know, transfer Pokemon to the uh, GameCube. Boy, was I wrong, and boy, like, boy, am I happy that I'm wrong, because, damn, that would have been a lot of money. So, that's exactly what I did. Now, I'm actually learning that game, and I'm kind of hoping on coming out with that walkthrough by the start of June. Who knows, I might just even come out with it once we hit 7,000 subscribers. And, as of right now, we are halfway there. Literally halfway there. We're at 6,950 subscribers. Again, thank you guys for the love and all that crud. And uh, who knows? Again, I might just come out with a, with Pokemon Coliseum a little earlier than expected. I kind of... I don't know. I kind of have like the first part down, but I, I, I still had to like look at other PokeTubers who have done Pokemon Coliseum to actually learn this game. So, again, it's a maybe. It's a 50-50 chance that I might come out with it early or not. I don't, I don't really know, guys. But, yes, Pokemon Coliseum is the next game after Liquid Crystal. Now, what game are, am I going to do after Omega Ruby? Well, that that right there is... Uh, I, I really don't know, guys. Uh, the thing is, I'm doing three, mainly because of this virus. I'm almost done because this virus is taking so goddamn long and is making me nuts. I don't know. I might just, uh, I might just stick with, I might just go back to one by the time this whole virus is done. Hopefully, I'll have like a bunch of uh, recordings afterwards because I think I dropped about a hundred uh, episodes within the month. I could be wrong. <laughs> I don't even know, guys. I don't even know. You, if, for those who have been keeping track, let me know how many episodes I've dropped within the start of the coronavirus all the way to right now. Whenever you guys like, you know, uh, see this episode right here. Okay, so let's see. We've already defeated it. Oh, wow. Oh, that song sounds crazy. I'll tell you this right up front. I'm a super crazy week. Oh, wow. Okay, so that was just like an anticlimactic right there. And, mm, damn. Delinquent Charlene wants to battle, and she's coming with her Sharpedo. Sharpedo's not that weak. What the hell are you talking about? She must be smoking the good, good. She must have been smoking that good, good stuff. Okay, so yeah guys, those are plans for the future and all that stuff. Uh, you guys already know that I like behind the scenes I'm actually recording uh, Pokemon X. And I know some of you guys are going to be a little, a little irritated that you didn't get the chance to pick the starter. But this is the game that I kind of want, want to choose the starter for myself because I do have a team already picked out. Didn't really need convincing and all that crud. And then, you know, hopefully, maybe, uh, we'll be getting done with Pokemon X as quickly as we, we're doing with these games right here. That's what Coronavirus is doing. It's completing this whole thing. And God dang you with the rough skin. Come on. Oh, look at that. Okay, so that is done. And, well, Sir Razor grows to level 25 right there. And Charlene, yes, see? Wow, she doesn't really have much belief in her Pokemon. Okay, so let's move on right here. And I think we already have, uh, yeah, I think we already have the Repel on. Now, let's see. In Pokemon Emerald, this is exactly where we captured our, our new Cybot and replaced Raiden with. I do have him on my PC. I did capture him in Pokemon Y? X? Before I restarted it? I don't know. Probably. I don't even know, guys. 
So let's go ahead and switch our, our Pokemon. Let's go straight back to Gaia the Fierce Knight because it needs loving and attention and all that stuff. And here we go. I'll check your Pokemon and see if they're fit for the outdoors. Bring it. Just bring it. Here we go. Going up against Pokemon Ranger Carlos and he's coming out with a Nuzlocke. Or Nuz... Leaf. God dang it. <laughs> oh, damn. Speaking of Nuzlocke's. Okay. Speaking of Nuzlocke's, I'm gonna I'm gonna answer this right now. I've had I've already had like probably three or four people uh, ask me about this. Will I ever do a Nuzlocke? Mm, that right there, I don't know if I, I'll ever do it because of the time constraint that I have right now. Uh, again, we're all thinking ahead of what's gonna happen later on in the future. You know, coronavirus or not. Uh, with the time, like the amount of time that I have. I just like to focus on the game. The specifics of the game, you know, the adventure and all that stuff. I get it. Nuzlocke challenges you and everything. See how good of a trainer you are. But that's not for me. Really, it isn't because I don't necessarily have a lot of time. That's probably the main reason to why we switched out to a new Gym Leader Draven channel and came back here. Because, yeah, not a lot of time. I was more focused on real life and all that stuff. I was really, like, I was ready to quit, and then thankfully, thankfully I didn't. And uh, look at that, Carlos has been defeated. Yeah, buddy! So, to answer that question, I don't think I will. Uh, who knows? Uh, that, that might change. That might change. So, never say never, guys. So, let's go ahead and battle this young leader right here, and how is your physical fitness? If you're not fit, you could not, or you could have a rough time in a critical situation. She is not joking. For those who don't know, I am in real life. I am a personal trainer, and I'm not really essential right now. But she's not joking about that whole critical situation. So again, guys, if you if you guys are in quarantine and all that stuff, try and get a little bit of a workout. You know, small workout, a jog, push-ups. You know that kind of stuff. Because uh, yeah, you don't want to be that fat fuck. You don't want to do that. Right? And look at that. Psychic attack. Lombre defeated. Suck it. Alrighty. The sombrero wearing mother lover. And look at that. Hydro number two grows level 49. Yes, it's become my strongest Pokemon right there. And well, let's go right ahead and use Desert Storm right here. Grumpig is coming out. We got a piggy. I smell bacon. Fun, uh, fun fact. Fun fact, I do have a sister, and she is a she is currently a police officer. That is hilarious. So, imagine how many uh, imagine how many uh, pig jokes I come out with her. That's right. Look at that earthquake attack. I do call her pig from time to time, but she doesn't necessarily believe it. She does fulfill, <laughs> she does fulfill the stereotype of a uh, of uh, being a police officer because every single time I train her and her partner. They're always talking about what they eat in the in the morning, and that's a donut. You see, it's not it's not necessarily untrue, <laughs> but yes, don't tell my sister. And here we go. Come on, Desert. God dang it, Desert Storm. Come on. Oh my God, no, 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 no. God dang it. Okay, well, Desert Storm's been fainted. We'll revive him. Okay, so who wants them? Uh, let's go with Sage of the Halo, and uh, let's let, let's just avenge our fallen friend right here. All right, Sage of the Halo, let's do your stuff right here. Let's go with the X Scissors right now because yeah, Psychic Pokemon do not like Bug type moves. You know what's funny? Every okay, so I tried that method out in Pokemon Red, Blue, and Yellow. That's when I found out that Psychic types do not like uh, or are not a or are weak against bug types. The only problem is there's only one bug type move in the Red, Blue, Yellow series, and that's uh, Pin Missile. And not all, not all the bug type Pokemon that you see, not not all of them learn it. There's only specific Pokemon that learn that move, and that one of them is Jolteon. Famously, it's Jolteon, and I know many of you guys want me to like use Jolteon eventually. Eventually, I'll use them. There's only one Evolution that I've ever used, and that was a uh, Relic right there. So let's see, let's go ahead and use this on Desert Storm. And now, okay, so now that we're on this, I, I gotta take a look and see what the egg is looking like because this guy doesn't want to hatch, and I think we're gonna have to go without hatching it. And, oh god. Really? We got you a month ago and you're still not hatching? WTF, man. WTF. So, yeah, we're gonna have to wait a while for that guy. 
let's go ahead and start battling some more Pokemon trainers right here. And uh, let's hear Dra good old Draven's uh, rants about stuff. You know, questionnaires and all that stuff. Now, there's only four people that I actually wanted to showcase on here. If I could remember anybody else's, then we'll see what happens. So here we go. Hex Maniac Tammy wants the battle, and she will be coming out with the Dust Skull right here. So let's go, Desert Storm. All right, Dust Skull, you a-hole. Well, let's get this uh, Dragon Breath right here. Eat it. Look at that. And yes, Paralysis. You gotta love Paralysis, yes. Okay, so what the, what the hell kind of move is that? Oh, yeah, the lag. Yeah, gotta, gotta expect the lagginess right here when you're doing a capture card. And look at that, the pursuit attack, nothing. You did nothing. So here we go again, another Dragon Breath. Come on, Desert Storm. Show them who the boss is. And yes, Duskull defeated America. That's right, guys. Patriotic and everything. And look at that, Sir Razor growing levels like crazy. And it's learning knockoff. Do you not want to teach it right now? Eventually, I'll teach them some good moves and all that stuff. And here she's coming out with a Sableye. So let's go right ahead and... Sableye, Sableye. You know what? Let's go with Sage of the Halo. Does Bug-type moves actually work on this guy? It's a Ghost and a Dark-type Pokemon. That's a good combination. That's like staying undefeated right there, guys. And look at that. Sableye looking crazy. Didn't know that it had fangs and everything. So let's go with Leaf Blade because... Shoot, I, I don't think bug type moves will actually work against this guy. Bam! And there we go. Sableye knocked out. Alrighty, look at that. Look at that, and look at that. Tammy. Tammy 1 has been defeated. Now, if you guys watch Parks and Recreation, Tammy 1, Tammy 2. Funny stuff, funny stuff. Okay, so let's go ahead and grab berries right here. We got three Ross berries. Bam! Three Ross berries. Awesome. Awesome sauce right there. And then we're grabbing the Aspir Berries, or Aspir, Aspir. I, I, I know I'm butchering names, guys. I know. Give me a break. Come on. You know how, how Draven is. And look at that. Four person berries. We're getting some berries right here. Let's see. Talk to this lady. This right here are the fields of, uh, for this route. It's hardly to, or it's handy to be able to fly, to use fly to get here. Oh, yeah. Oh, but dear me. I bet you can't use fly, yet you get here, can you? Keep going all the way to Lily Cove if you want to be able to fly straight back here in the future. Once you can, it's really convenient. Oh, well, she is actually explaining that now in this game right here, you can actually fly straight to diff like to specific routes. So let me go ahead and uh, just show you right here. All right, so now, uh, well, you guys can't see the maps, right? But it says Route 121. You can actually fly right here. So actually, come on. Actually, you know what? It's not going to even do it right now. So, you can actually fly through specific routes. And, uh, well, let's see. I'm not going to teach you guys that right now. So, let's go ahead and switch out. We got to get to Lily Cove. I know I've been talking a lot, guys. Shouting out, everybody. Uh, let's see. Talk to this lady. Stop! Have a good look at my precious Pokemon. Okay. Alrighty. Let's see. Look at that. Beauty Jessica. Hmm. I actually dated to Jessica back then. Hilarious. And here she comes with a Kecleon right now. And let's go with Gaia the Fierce Knight. All right, Gaia. You don't like him, or you don't like her, and she doesn't like you. So let's go right ahead and use... Yeah, let's go with a Dazzling Gleam. Let's be a dick about that. Bam. Oh, yes. And that nearly takes Kecleon out. So... It turned into a fairy type Pokemon, and now it's using Camouflage. Come on, use a different move, and it's a Grass type. Okay, so no weaknesses on my behalf right there. So let's go ahead and use a Psychic Attack. Bam! For the win. Alrighty, Kecleon. Defeated. I think I captured that Kecleon a few episodes ago. I think I did. And look at that. Experience share. Sage of the Halo grows to level 48. And here she's coming out with a Surviper. I'm going to stay put right here. And let's go with... Bam. You know it. You love it. Psychic attack. Bam. Oh, yeah. No more Surviper. Alrighty. Alrighty. Anywho, guys. Let's see. I think I've already mentioned I'm close to 7,000 subscribers. And, uh, well... That, well, my goal 
I don't know if that's... I don't even know if it's possible, especially in this year, because we got, like, what, seven months left? And before that, take a look at this. All right. We are leaving to Mount Power. We are going to obtain that orb before Team Aqua does. An orb? The uh, hell are you talking about? Orb. An orb? Okay, alrighty. So, they're talking about some kind of orb right here. Alrighty, so, if you go right here, you, you may be able to find something right now. Okay, so cut this. And, let's see. The repellent has worn off. I'm not going to use it right now. Oh, look at that. There's a, another secret base, and we found ourselves a zinc. Always good. That's good. Awesome. Okay, so let's go into this secret base and obtain another flag. Let's see. Who is this? Another... Oh, wow. Another... I don't know... I don't know who, who who's bad or whose base is this, but again, if you see your base on here on my channel, that's a shout out to you. And look at that, we got 39 flags, gravy, and we're not gonna be battling anybody right now because, uh, yeah, not ready for that kind of smoke. So let's move on right here, and that thing regrew quickly. Wow. So let's go cut this good old buddy, Sir Razor, and. Let's see. Oh, there's another secret base right there. I think I should use a uh, a, a repel for that. Because I do not want to get attacked by any Pokemon right now. Okay. Alrighty. So, maximum effort. Let's see who's in here. And Team Catastrophe. Your base has been showcased on my channel. So, if you're the owner of Team Catastrophe... Hello? This is a... Uh, you're on my channel now and look at that 40 flags and let's see what this person has oh look at that slide look at that it's awesome now sometimes people like to be assholes and they just like to cover up the the flags because they don't want their flags to be taken away or they cover up the the leader of this whole base right here that that right there bothers me so like sometimes you know just it's frustrating and stuff Okay, so let's see, Route 121, and oh, look at that, another secret base. We're getting secret bases here. Okay, Team Secret, or Super Secret. Team Super Secret. And we got ourselves another flag right here. Look at that, Team Super Secret's base is here. Alrighty, so let's go and, bat and do a double battle now because it's been a, a while. So there we go. We're together, nothing scares us. We'll show you how great we are. When we're together, nothing scares us. We'll show you how great we are. Okay, they, sh they just said the same thing right there. Okay, so here we go. Battling uh, teammates Kate and Joy. And uh, look at that. Spinda and Slanking. Two good Pokemon right here. I think one's a defensive Pokemon and the other one's very, very offensive. So here we go. Look at that. Oh, yeah. Shiny Pokemon. Oh, uh, yes. Look at that getting that treatment and here's that trace tangled feet I don't know what that does so let's go right ahead and use dazzling gleam on both and let's use this surf on everybody because we can so here we go surf attack let's get it BAM and of course the lag is coming but here comes that dazzling gleam and spin the faints but that god Dang, Vicarath, not Vicarath, Slack Auth or Slack King is just like, oh crap, bam, using its a uh, high attack. So now the next move it won't do anything. So let's go with a simple Charge Beam to this guy, and let's go straight to Crunch on this guy. And look at that, look at that, no mercy from Draven. Suck on that. Alrighty, okay. Okay, look at that. My Pokemon are uh, growing levels, taking, kicking ass, taking names, and uh, it's learning Sweet Scent. I'm not teaching you Sweet Scent because uh, why should I? Okay, so we defeated the Kate and Joy, and yes, I'm feeling victorious. I'm very victorious, and uh, let's see. So, as you can see right here, this is the, uh, what was it called? Uh, the Safari Zone, which we will be heading later. I think we're going to take like three episodes to just explore the whole corridor right here because there's a lot of stuff that you can actually find right here guys and let's grab this we found ourselves a max repel which you know we are not we we never we don't have a problem with that and well let's see there is a pokemon trainer waiting for us right here let's go ahead and switch to sage of the halo and let's just start destroying everybody so let's see what you got 
With my Pokemon, I have traveled the four or the world's four corners. You may say I have some confidence in my abilities. Alrighty, okay. When I drink tea with my niece, we always go pinky up. That's right. Gentleman Walter wants the battle. And he's coming with the maniac trick right here. Okay, alrighty. And here comes Sage of the Halo. Ronin Warriors. Eventually, I'm going to name uh, another Pokemon. Kento. And Kento of Hard Rock. Sigh of the... Uh, let's see. Sigh of the, uh, the Strata. Yeah, Sigh of the Strata. And Ryu of the Wildfire. Yeah, we got three more Pokemon. And then, you know, we got the Turtle Pokemon as well. Eventually, we'll, we'll get those guys too. And look at that, gentlemen. He got, he got beaten up. That's right. Okay, so that's one guy down. And there are Pokemon here that want to be captured by me, but I do not want to capture you. I already ca captured your, 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 your pre evolved form and all that crud. And look at that. The medicine. And yes, we're going to be needing another repel because crud, there's a lot of Pokemon right here. And nothing right here. So let's go straight forward. And let's see if we can get in here. No, nope, we need a cut. Okay, so let's battle this lady right here. Will you play with my delightfully pretty Pokemon? Heck yes, I will. Alrighty, so let's go. Pokefan Vanessa wants the battle. Believe it or not, I actually dated a Vanessa as well. <laughs> There's quite a few girls that I've dated, and I think most of their names are right here, so that's hilarious, guys. So let's go. Let's use Leaf Blade on poor Pikachu right here. Oh, crud. Look at that, Pikachu. You're getting defeated. And, ah, oh, Jeebus. Look at that. Static. No good. Ah, oh, jeez. Ah, oh, damn. And... Well, everybody's getting levels, and welcome to the level 50 club. Hydra number two is the first of our Pokemon right here. And, well, let's go right ahead and... Uh, you know what? Screw it. I don't need Hyper Beam right now. I do have different kinds of... I do have different Hydras. So I will be teaching the other Hydras Hyper Beam and all that stuff. I, I will have different movesets with these guys. And look at that. We defeated Vanessa. And, yes, we are very, very mean right now. So let's go ahead and cut this one here. So, Sir Razor, do your job. Yeah, buddy, look at that. That's good, that's good. And here's a Shiny Stone. Look at that. Yeah, buddy. Okay. So, Shiny Stone, I believe, will evolve... Yeah, it will evolve our Gaia number two. So I might just do that off screen. And let's see, there's nothing right there. There is a ghost type Pokemon that wants us to capture it, but we will not do that on screen. And oh, look at that. More berries. Yeah, buddy. Lots and lots of Nana berries. You guys to love the Nana berries. Yeah, buddy. Okay, so we got that. Look at that. Yeah, buddy. Another Nana berries. Okay, and here we go. Oh, wow. Seriously? Okay. Here we go, Nana Berries again. And look at that. Look at that. Okay, so we've already gotten those Nana Berries, and now, let's see, we are close. We are very close. I, I can sniff it, and no, we don't need it. I can sniff the next town, and uh, yeah, buddy. Here we are, Lily Cove Town. Finally, after so many episodes. I think this is episode 50. I could be wrong. I don't even know, guys. So, stay tuned, guys. In the next episode, uh, we're going to be taking a small tour of Lily Cove Town. And... Well, let's see, what else is there to do? Yeah, Lily Cove Town, we're going to be doing some side quests. Mainly the Safari Zone, uh, Route 121, uh, just a bunch of stuff, guys, as time allows. You do know that I'm trying to maximize the amount of episodes you'll find here. So, uh, thank you guys again for watching this walkthrough episode. Thank you guys for the subs. Uh, again, we're trying to get 7,000. I'll talk to you guys about my goal next episode and uh yeah follow me twitter facebook instagram that kind of stuff yeah that kind of stuff so i'm gonna stop talking guys i'll see you guys next episode see you guys